on to the head of Austin and home for Swindon. And what a return this is. A goal on his return. Lovely little dink into the area. Oh, that's some goal. What a goal. Let's play forwards. And probing again. That's a really smart save, but only as far as Williams. And pretty sure they're going to win this one today from now. And the space here for Darcy. And Darcy with a fourth. And it gets better for the hosts. Swindon did win the reverse fixture 2 1 away in September. And they're looking to add more damage. And it's Khan to keep going in the right direction. They've got work to do here as Swindon worked the ball into the area. That didn't take long. Johnny Williams with the effort into the far corner. And now it's Charlie Austin who has the opportunity to pull a goal back here. Austin for Swindon just about sends the ball over the goal line to give Swindon a route back into the game. To Hepburn Murphy who is away. Has a quick look up, delivers the ball in towards Austin! 3-3! And Dolo with a good cross. Met late and in. And they do have one back. it out to Hutton, Hutton gets the ball in and that's an unorthodox effort on Swindon a level, Jacob Wakeling makes it 1-1 with a wonderful finish, Swindon looking to build here, there's an opportunity in behind for the substitute to Ronan Darcy, Darcy in plenty of space, all across the face of goal, it's an own goal, and Elliot Watt has put past Alex Cairns, and Swindon have turned this match on its head at the start of the second half. January 2nd and January 27th because of postponements. The ball in for Martin is well met by Hepburn Murphy. Less than 10 plays. And here's Wickling in behind again. Hepburn Murphy's there. And in slow motion, Swindon go to it. Fancy keeping hold of it on a hat trick. Still Tomlinson. Still Tomlinson. Still Tomlinson. Three. Will he make frame that in front of his own fans? Not sure it's his goal. They have already taken a point off Orient this season. 1 1 at the county ground. Now then, chance to get in behind. Wakeling the substitutes has equalised for Swindon. It's a cracking goal as well on the counter against the run of play. But Swindon are level. Hutton loves to get forward. His cross into the area looks pretty good. And Austin announces his return to the lineup with a quick goal here. Two minutes on the clock. Again, it's Swindon who are on the attack. They're up into the area. The ball squeezed to the far post. And Austin is there again to link up with Hepburn Murphy. 12 minutes gone. Rochdale nil, Swindon two. Up into a good position here. Shifts it wide, makes his way up into the area. Waiting for the delivery. Instead, it comes to Darcy who... Moves the ball on, cries of shoot. Anytime anyone is anywhere near the penalty area in this game. Oh, it's Austin who's in there again. His hat trick. See more goal mouth action, that's for sure. Hasn't been too much in the way of decent defending. Swindon on their way. Oh, it's the pick of the bunch for Charlie Austin who makes it four. Murphy, works space for the shots. 
And it's an early stunner for Swindon. Sunshine are coming forward with Hutton. Hutton twisting and turning, trying to get the ball in, and he does, and there is the opening goal. Four minutes on the clock, and Hepburn Murphy puts the home side ahead. Place at the end of the season is always slim. One behind here, a chance to pull one back. It is Johnny Williams. It's surely no more than a consolation. Ball gets it back, and he makes the right option to the right-hand side. And it goes, Williams! Swindon lead. And of course, it was Johnny Williams. And Jeff Cop in need of a goal, and he's got one. Tucked away into the corner. It worked by Swindon as the cross comes in towards the back post, and they've turned it around. Two goals in three minutes. Oh dear, it's a dreadful mistake by Janov, and he might just pay the price. Indeed, he does. Put away by Luke Jeffcott, his second of the afternoon. Just over the hour mark here as Hutton sends in the cross, and it's a towering header and a fantastic goal for Thomas Clayton. And some way for him to get his first for the club. So Darcy, who was denied by the handball, steps up to score. Wimbledon one, Swindon five. Collins. This pass is intercepted. Look at the space here. Oh, lovely finish. Russian Hepburn Murphy makes Peterborough pay. Great start from Swindon, though. Good ball into the box. Needed to make the header. Back in it comes. And the opening goal. Goes Swindon's way. And it's Godwin Malife. Looking for that uh, second goal. Blake Tracy. And that's well hit. Brilliantly hit. Jake Young. Two minutes after half time. And two minutes after coming on. His first Swindon goal. And it was a rocket. Forward on his former tear. Like the whistle, do you think? Swindon attacking. In numbers here as it goes into Austin, there's the save, and there's the rebound, tapped in from a yard out. Dan Kemp gets the goal, an easy, easy finish for him. It's all about Swindon at the moment as they continue to come forward. That's chipped into a dangerous area. Austin doesn't do anything with it as the shot comes in. Oh my goodness me, what a goal. Fraser, Blake, Tracy up from the back with an absolute cannonball of a shot. The Swindon defender showing the attackers how to do it. To get out here, being pinned in by Swindon. A deep delivery towards the back post ahead of back across goal. And Swindon into the lead. Jake Young at it again. Scored against Crew last week. Hold up by Mendy. Here comes the cross and Austin looking to get on the end of it. And he makes it 2-0. His first of the season. Players ahead of the ball here. Here's Kemp. Can he engineer some space on the edge of the area? He can do more than that. A wonderful finish. And Swindon restore their two-goal advantage. By Barnett, but he's given it away cheaply. With Kekrick. Heavy touch from him, but it falls kindly, and it's four! Slammed home by Jake Young. His second of the game. And Swindon, fine game is so open. 
as Swindon pull forward once again. Here's Young. Now Kemp. Still Kemp working it onto his left foot. And he makes it 5 3. Swindon. And Jacob Wakeling, who can surge over halfway and burst down the right hand side. Still going Wakeling into the six yard box. Is that here, Walters? It has. Roy Walters with a disastrous own goal. Also wanted to get also a winning start. High, disastrous, and it's another goal for Swindon Town. Swindon will carry on regardless with Kemp. Looking for the return. Kemp into the box. And Kemp opens the scoring. Swindon Town in front. Kemp, third time of asking. Here's Young. It's a tight angle. What a finish. Jake Young making it 2 0. Kemp. Young. 3 0. Well, Young was the provider for Kemp in the first half. Put and he's on the ropes. Kemp. Oh, that's brilliant. Kemp across. Patrick! And that partnership yet again proving dividends for... It's a decent ball in. It's him again. It's 5-0 Swindon and Jake Young has four. I haven't gone four unbeaten since 2016. And there could still be some icing on the cake. Shade. Nil Swindon Town. Tyree Shade. Oh, to put the ball into a good position here for Sutton. Can he swept away? Charlie Austin plays it wide, and it's Jake Young here. Young still going. Young will go for goal. Had no right to score from there, but the goals do keep on flowing for the Swindon Town Lone. Long was the target. Hasn't been cleared away completely by Sutton. And it has been smashed in by Jack Kane. Good looking ball to the back of the area. Charlie Austin can't quite turn it over the goal line. Although he's still scrapping for it. And Jake Long can finish off the move. His second of the afternoon is now straight to Swindon. Julie dispatched by Dan Kemp. Sutton pushing and pushing for the equaliser. Ben Murphy again, a driving run. And it's goal number five. For the third time this season, Swindon have five goals. Swindon looking for a positive start. That's Hutton's cross onto the head of Austin and in. What a start for Swindon. Barely any time on the clock. And Swindon already in front. Charlie Austin with his second league goal of the season. Brilliant. This intricately though. Good football from the hosts, but oh, that's a poor back pass. Dreadful defending. And that kills it off, surely. Russian Hepburn Murphy with the second, two minutes from time, and that should be that for Swindon. Well, it's good football here from Swindon, who worked their way into the area. Young lifts one in, and just like that, Swindon ahead. Dan Kemp is there diving in, 12 minutes on the clock, and the away side leads. Charlie Austin then, from the spot, makes sure, finds the corner, Morkham 1, Swindon 2. One of four unbeaten clubs still in the EFL. Preston, Portsmouth, Swindon and Mansfield. Looking for the opening goal and they've got it. It's a super strike. 26 minutes gone at the county ground. Dan Kemp with lift off for Swindon. And it's a fabulous finish. Lovely ball, it was Kemp. And what a finish that is. 
Jake Kane. And are those the points secured now for Swindon Town? That is a brilliant goal. Well, the hope for Swindon is that uh, Notts County have conceded 19 goals this season. That's a good ball in. And powered home with the header. And maybe this is a route back. Tyree Shade off the bench at half time. Drop into the middle, Bennett. He's made that loose and Kemp's been released and the goalkeeper's rushed out here. Kemp goes round him and slots into the bottom corner. Well, well, well. Where was Johnny Maxted going? Rushed out of his goal. And he finds an end product, lays his back to Khan. He's got a bit of time on the box, he's pushed away, but he'll come back out. To burn my thing to surely wrap up the points. 2 0 for Swindon. Peace. Many in the box. The elect to go outside it. So Hutton and rush it in and tuck it in the level up. It's 1 1 here. 11 minutes played. His first EFL goal. Austin from the spot. Scores. Swindon turning around after knocking on the door they found the way tilt sent off Austin Austin leaves it for Jake Young don't give him room to shoot because he will do that 10 goals now for the season for Jake Young and it's a goal to get him to number 10 that's a by McCacker and goes in there Blake Tracy meets it and it's 3-2 no time to celebrate. I've been looking for at least something here. Dan Kemp's done well, and Dan Kemp has squeezed it in. Well, in their last three games coming into this, Swindon, but they can't have been expecting this. Kemp's still going again. Oh, and he scored again. Big turnaround in the balance of play, albeit the damage has uh, long since been done. But Swindon have another one back. Charlie Austin. Hey, Swindon, but has still been uh, nowhere near Alder Shot Town. They might yet have a fourth. They do. Charlie Austin, he's got another one. Blake Tracy looking for room. Finds ahead of him Jake Young. Young with the strike. It's what he's been doing all season. And it's goal number 11 in the league. A fierce drive into the bottom corner here. And Swindon are up and running. Lost the last four in all competitions. There's a chance though, it's Kemp winding one up, deflected. And it's in. And against the run of play, Swindon take the lead against the leaders. 3-1 defeat at Colchester in midweek. And the 7-4 thumping by non-league Aldershot here last Saturday. And they've turned it round again, and it's Jake Young on the hour mark for Swindon. Fake to Kemp, who now finds Jake Young. He could go left, he could go right, he could go on his own, and he goes on his own and produces that. Quite brilliant from Jake Young. Swindon have the lead. God eventually stayed in the pockets, but here's Young for Swindon, and he scores. What a beautifully crafted goal for Swindon Town. Into stoppage time at the county ground. Austin rising, Austin off the post. It's back to him, he swivels and it's Young and it's in for Swindon. Incredible. 93 minutes on the clock. And Mansfield's unbeaten start surely is going to end now. And cool, he slotted down the middle by Kemp. That's him into double figures for the league season now. Coming together with Longelo. And they're making hay down the right and thumped into the back of the net. Jake Young. Hutton. Can urge to shoot. Oh, why not? If you're going to score your first goal of the season. That's a nice touch. And Hutton will get there. Across it comes. And slotted home. As he's done for pr pretty much his whole career. 
Charlie Austin just off the bench. She precious little of that so far. Pick down the line is a decent one. Opportunity for a cutback. Oh, Kemp has found the net from an improbable, impossible angle. And questions have to be asked about how he beat Luke McGee from there. Swindon, nice touch, that vital touch by Kemp. And they've gone long towards Young. Hasn't got much options, headed away. Does fall back to Kemp. Goes for the goal, scores! Oh, yes! So, uh, with Linton. Shad. Nice, go sent you to Khan. Lovely move down this left side. Three weight in the middle. Kemp gets another. Two for Swindon. They retake the lead as we get in.